Hey everybody, it's me, Frozen Strawberry Juanita, and this is probably one of the first times you've actually heard me say that, but I thought that I would go ahead and say it due to the nature of this video. So first off, I want to say thank you to all of my wonderful subscribers. I really do appreciate you all, and a special thank you to all of those people and individuals who were concerned about something that they took the time out to inbox me about. So first off, just thank you so much. Um, it was brought to my attention, and I kind of noticed it too, that someone uh, thought that it would be a good idea to copy um, my video content and post it to their own YouTube channel. Now, what I'm referring to is not a share and add to a playlist. No, this person downloaded my YouTube video content and uploaded it to their own channel and monetized it as if it was their own. So let's get this out of the way right now. I don't appreciate that. So that there's no confusion. I didn't appreciate it and I don't appreciate that type of behavior. I don't appreciate someone doing things without my permission. If something belongs to me, do not take it from me without permission. So there you go. Um, the next thing with this that I thought I would also share, if you're someone who is a YouTube uh, blogger, um, you're an admin to a YouTube channel, you put a lot of content out there, and um, you notice that someone is copying your content, there are some steps that you can take to deal with it. So I just thought that I would put that out there just in case you you stumble across this video and you've never had it happen to you or you think it never has happened to you. That way you can go search yourself on YouTube and if you see that someone is doing it, you can take the steps necessary to take care of it. Um, the thing that really uh, concerned me with this was not only were they downloading my content without asking me they were trying to monetize it and make money off of my work i don't appreciate that type of behavior at all so moving along i thought that i would actually use this as an opportunity for a topic and it's how do you feel when someone violates your trust or when someone violates your personal space or they do something that you don't feel comfortable with do you confront them directly or do you internalize it or do you have some other method of dealing with the issue so for me personally i have a really tight um small list of people that i consider to be my friend and i've always thought that it was interesting to hear what other people thought a friend is so if you have the time feel free and put your definition of what you consider a friend to be below in the comments or inbox me what you think about it or even do a video response so I'm just really curious what do you consider the criteria of a friend to be for me a friend is someone who you can talk to spend time with and share information and even go hang out and do things with and there are no what's the word for this there are no hang-ups with it there are no um issues with this person that you have to worry about if they're going to be okay with you a friend is someone who accepts you just the way that you are and they accept you even with all of your little quirks and stuff and you it is someone that you can feel safe around and you can just be yourself that's my definition of a friend um, so hopefully I ended this video on a more of a positive note, but just in case you just stumbled across this video and you were curious about my channel and me. So first off, my YouTube channel, it started off, um, when I came back to YouTube about my hair journeys and what was going on my mind and then it as uh, time went on I branched out and did outfit of the days and things like that as well so uh, as far as who records the videos because I get asked that a lot 
I record the videos myself. I take all my pictures myself and I do all of the editing myself. So that's who's in charge of all that. And the person who's answering the YouTube comments and stuff like that, that would be me. So I don't have an admin, um, an outside admin. I'm actually the one who does all of that stuff. Just for all those people who ask me that question. Um, so I hope everybody's doing good, staying blessed and feeling well. And I will see you all next time. Feel free to subscribe, like, and share your thoughts and comments. See you.